Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another one of my movie reviews. Uh, this is my Three Identical Strangers movie review. Uh, I watched this movie on Amazon Prime uh, maybe a couple weeks ago. I'm a little bit late uh, with my review. And um, I thoroughly enjoyed this documentary. I found this movie enthralling. In fact, if I had to use a word to describe this movie, it would be enthralling. Um, I cannot believe this movie is not nominated for an Academy Award for Best Picture. That is just, uh, I don't know how. I mean, I, the Mr. Rogers movie didn't get nominated either, which is also like, what? Really? How? Um, so this movie is directed by Tim Wardle. I don't know what he's done or any anything like that. Uh, there's a cast listed. I don't really know why. Um, it's not a film... Uh, it's, it's not a it's not a narrative film it's a documentary and um, I'm gonna have spoilers in this um, so th this movie is about these th uh, triplets who were separated at birth and um, here's the spoilers coming up okay um, well it, it, you know first let me rate it uh, if I had to rate this movie on the Star Strider scale I'd give it an 83 um, it is an excellent movie. Um, the, the reasons for these triplets getting separated was really was really upsetting. Um, I, I, it, it takes a twist, and there's a lot of things that happen, and I, I, I don't know how much you attribute of kind of bad stuff that happened to these three these three triplets who were separated um, I, I thought it was evil what was done to these kids all in the name of science um, that's just kind of the spoiler um, they, they were basically running an experiment to see how they would turn out if you split them up and put them in different types of homes and the worst part of it all is that the study was never published so it was all for naught um, it, it really upset me man you don't play with people's lives like that like they're guinea pigs. Um, I would have found it fascinating, if anything, that uh, to see what were the results of the study, but I think that doctor is long dead. Um, and um, that is most unfortunate, but if you're into documentaries, um, this is so well done. This is one of the most well done documentaries I've seen. This past year was actually a year of really good documentaries. Um, and only one of them that I've seen got nominated, which was Free Solo. This didn't get nominated, and Won't You Be My Neighbor did not get nominated. Um, that's a travesty in and of itself. Um, I would highly recommend this movie. Like I said, I saw it on Amazon Prime. Go see this movie, please. It's, uh, or, or download this movie, I guess. You don't go see it. Um... The, these these triplets actually got kind of famous back when this happened, and they were on all these talk shows. And um, you know, to get back into spoilers, one of them ended up killing himself. And I, I think, in my opinion, what happened with that twin was that, or that triplet was that his adopted family. It seemed like he didn't fit in so well, and when he met his other two brothers, he finally felt like he had that family that he had been missing. And when the three went into business together, they kind of used their fame to launch a business, which was like a happening spot, I guess, in the 80s, to be in New York City. One of them laughed, and that somewhat fell apart. And that triplet ended up killing himself, which is unfortunate. I do think that... It's difficult to say, but I, I think if he had had his brothers there the whole time, he may have... He may still be alive. Um, that is a most unfortunate issue, and um, I don't know why those studies are locked. I don't see how a... Uh, I believe they're at a university. How can a university lock a study like that? Especially if you're the subject. Um, I really hope that maybe some lawyer um, subpoenas that information, or some judge... I think the people who are the subjects of the experiment have a right to know. But I, I would highly recommend going to see this if you're into documentaries and you like learning about interesting stories. Um, my hearts go out to a lot of the 
people that were the subjects of these. It wasn't just these these three. There were other sets of twins as well that were involved in this study, and some that may, may be out there that don't even know that they have a long lost twin, um, or maybe triplet, and don't know that they were a part of this study, because it was pure chance that these three found each other. Um, anyways, I, I found it completely enthralling. And uh, did you guys see it? Um, let me know, leave your comments, like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Okay, bye.